Coming up on seven. Move it out, Shiv. Oh, oh yeah. Hero, huh? Identifying prisoner 117. Shiv, Helix. You think you can break me, copper? Yeah, I've been in the darkest pits in the universe. Places that would make your vaults rattle. The eternity pits of sword doom. The iron holding no balance. <laughs> Greetings, new fish. I'm... Captain Quark. I... I don't believe it. You're here! I used to dream of being arrested by you. Now get out of here. I was talking to you, Zed. Yes, Captain. So, new fish, I take it you followed my many, many adventures? Of course I have. You're the most famous superhero in the galaxy. He ain't famous anymore. <laughs> Words hurt, solitary Bill. I'm a huge fan. I even pre-ordered the new Ratchet and Clank Hollow game. The what? You know, the game based on that incident with you and that Lombax. Oh, you must mean the Hollow film. Yeah, it's pretty good. If you like all CG. No, I mean the game. It's based on the Hollow film. Look, here's my confirmation email. I'm having it mag shipped to prison. <laughs> They're making a game based on the Hollow film based on my life? But they haven't even consulted me. Oh, this is my fault. I've been away from my adoring public in this forsaken place too long. And now, no one will ever hear my side. I'd like to hear your side, Captain. You would? Well, then sit down, wary criminal, and I'll tell you a story. It all started with a hapless Lombax named Ratchet. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? Hey, Grim, you're here. I I thought you'd be down at the bazaar shopping for gravity coils. Uh huh. Well, I'm here. I'm always here. I don't suppose you sneaking out would have anything to do with those Galactic Ranger tryouts? I just need one hour. Come on, Grim. These are the Galactic Rangers we're talking about. Captain Quark will be there. No leaving the garage until you help fix Mr. Micron's ship. Now get on that bolt crank. Does that ship look mag-lifted to you? Get on that fault crank, come on! Come on, give it a spin. Okay, let's see if these new Versa bulbs work. Look up, do you see something flashing? Yep, left side looks good. It's a miracle. On to the afterburner lights. Look down. Lower left afterburner light checks out. This thing might just be space-worthy after all. What? Lower right afterburner works. So, are we good? Yep, we're good. The news says the tryouts are being held at the fairgrounds. Show them what you got, kid. And so, Ratchet began his adventure, hoping to become a galactic ranger. Rise and shine. Ratchet bashed his enemies using his trusty Omni Wrench. Yes. In order to best his foes, Ratchet used the warrior's time honored tradition of jumping. Ratchet knew he faced mortal peril. Should he find himself on the verge of death, he'd need to find nanotech to heal. <laughs> I used that stuff after a bank robbery once. It healed, like, three out of five gunshot wounds.
Lurks displayed a flagrant disregard for public property. Look at him, smashing crates. <laughs> the hubris. Maybe he's just saving up bolts so he can buy a new weapon to protect the galaxy with. Hey, who's telling the story here? His enemies vanquished. Ratchet forged ahead. His destination? Destiny. here show us how quick you can be on your feet by jumping over these obstacles good work now keep moving to the next part of the course a good ranger is always mindful of their surroundings hop across these moving platforms many of you have been asking for tips sage advice if you will from your humble galactic protector Whenever my life is in jeopardy, I think of one simple guideline. Try not to die. I find that keeping this in my mind's brain helps... Good job! You could be the recruit we've been looking for. Keep moving to the next part of the course. Hey there, recruit. I'm Brax Electris, and my specialty is brute force. Let's see how well you can bash these crates. It's time to get our hands on some firepower. Go ahead and grab a fusion grenade glove from this Gadgetron vendor. Good choice. Awesome. Next step, blow stuff up. The Solana Galaxy is a perilous place, as evidenced by the large amounts of ammunition left sitting around in crates. Not run up and insist on shaking hands. My mighty vice like grip has been known to shake the confidence hey! of the most heroic of men. And I would. In order to spice things up, we've armed these dummies with gadgets on flamethrowers. Our lawyers are totally cool with this. Good job, recruit. You may just be the next Galactic Ranger. Head to the final challenge. Come on, Ratchet. You can do this. Time for the final challenge. To survive a brutal onslaught of enemies. And you just might be our next Galactic Ranger. Or... One down. like some angry toes. Impressive. Could we be looking at Solana's next Galactic Ranger? Another one down. Excellent job, Cadet. Come see me after the show. Huh. That wasn't so bad.
helpless defect knew that his best chance for survival lay with the facility's ventilation system. If he could just run to the vent, he might just make it out of there alive. I know you will find the defect. You never disappoint. Feeble Defect knew that if he were to survive, he would have to throw a bomb at whatever lay in his path. The young Defect spotted a spring bot ahead of him and knew that with this handy device in his arsenal, he could now defeat the deadliest of forces, gravity. The hopeless Defect had to throw a spring bot, but where and how? <laughs> There you are. Oh, my. Quit your running, you useless piece of scrap. Get back here and let's settle! <laughs> Get back here and let's settle this. Warbot to Warbot. Oh no, water. Suddenly, the defect spotted a power bot. This device could power up a variety of machines. But where should he throw it? <laughs> You're like really good at adding drama, man. Thank you, Shiv. I pride myself on my penchant for storytelling. What seems to be the problem, Fitcher? You won't get away from me, Chairman. I've got him right where I want him. Oh. 
You think you can run from me? Not that brute again. Get back here, you miserable defect! Million thoughts race through Ratchet's head. Could he repair this diminutive war box? Would it be the key to the adventure he craved? Did he leave the proto engine on in the garage? The answer to all these questions was yes. All right, hang on. I'll get us back to the garage. Large gaps were child's play to Ratchet. All he would need to get across is a trusty swing shot and a little bravado. Fortunately for our furry hero, a conveniently placed crate provided Ratchet with a combustor. Nice! A combustor! Ratchet basked in the freedom of being able to switch weapons whenever he felt like it. you could shoot something to open the door. My sensors indicate... Impressive shooting. Oh, 
Oh boy, out of ammo. Nice work. Blark, what are they doing here? I have information in my databanks that poses a threat to Chairman Dredd. He must have tracked my position to your planet so he could get it back. Ratchet was in a bad way. Ratchet had to think fast. Perhaps the hookshot would solve his current conundrum. Listen to me. I want you to lock the garage doors and then head down into the shelter. I'll be there as soon as I can. Copy that, Ratchet. Woohoo! Whoa, is that a Blarg dropship? Correct. Model X6V to be exact. Also known as the dropship of death. Great. <laughs> We gotta look for some defect. Ah, uh, it's not that bad. Oh no, the blarg are all over Grim's garage. Grim, are you okay? I'm fine, kid, but I ain't opening up Ooh. until the coast is clear. Just hold tight, Grim. I got this. Lock it Enemy down. Detected. 
Destroy target. War bots. I'm down in the shelter. Ratchet. This place is a mess. <clears throat> Disassembled weapons and engine parts everywhere. Didn't you tell me you were going to clean it up last week? Yeah, sorry about that. Got held up on a project. The beginner's guide to quantum burst engines. Just go that anywhere. I have a bookmark. What's this? Fun with singularities and other cataclysmic events. <laughs> That's really more for educational purposes. It is always good to meet a fellow academic. Really, I just look at the pictures and then, you know, wing it. Coast is clear. Can you open up? Ratchet, what in Sony's name just exploded? Sorry about that, Grim. Listen, get my tools ready. I just found something in the desert I need to look at. Interesting. What kind of factory is this? This? No, oh, this is just a garage. Lived here since I was a kid. Come on, let's get you fixed up. Well, it's damaged, but I fixed worse. Come on, maybe there's someone in town who can help us. Wait a second, is that raritanium? Maybe we should upgrade our weapons first.
how you make a great weapon even better! There's a lot of bad guys. Attention, citizens! You may have noticed we are in the midst of a small insignificant invasion. We are working hard to contact the guards so we can find a peaceful resolution. But until they return our call, it's probably best to remain in your ever to be selected for the Galactic Rangers. Cora Verilux statue. She's the youngest recruit ever to be selected for the Galactic Rangers. the last of them. Ouch! That one 
anyone hurt. Them. That must be the mayor's ship. This is a transmission for the Galactic Rangers. Please, with your assistance, this is Agno Buckwash, mayor of the Toblox Crater of Novalis. Mayor Buckwash will not last long without our help. Yes. Oh boy, out of ammo. We are happy to be of assistance. Why is Drek trying to kill you? It's my nephew, Skid McMarks. Wait, Skid McMarks, the pro hoverboarder? He sent me this infobot from Iridia, and the Blarg have been after me ever since. Here, take a look. Hey, Uncle Bogwash! Skid McMarks here. You know, your nephew. My agent and I are at the awesome grand opening of the McMarks Sports Shack here on Iridia. And boy, is this been a trip. I've gotten to meet all kinds of people. Fans, celebrities, my Gadgetron sponsors. I even got to sign autographs for these odd-looking creatures called the Flarg. <laughs> I guess they're doing something here on Iridia. Wait, uh, hold on a second. Hydro Harvester Super Illegal Water Displacement Apparatus. Um, I don't think I was supposed to have this. Stop him! He's got the schematics! Help! Someone! Call my agent! Call my publicist! Actually, don't call either of those people. Call someone who cares about me! I don't want to die! Sounds like Skid McMarks is in trouble. We gotta get to Iridia. Agreed. But we must first repair our ship. Right. Okay. Let's see if we can find some help. Attention, citizens! Your mayor is safe and sound. Hey? I was rescued by a furry hero and his robot friend. I will now resume regular office hours, which is every third Tuesday from 10 to 10.30. <laughs> some weapons step into my office actually i ain't got no office but i might get one if i make salesman of the month Use that vendor and put this to good use. Look 
broke out. Jumped and jumped and seriously, what's with all the jumping? Darn dog, you've jammed the transmission! Who's gonna save us now? Oh, hello there. I'm glad you're here. I've been... Hey, have we met before? Because I'm getting a touch of the old deja vu. Uh, I don't think so. Huh. Well, guess the old think tank could use a good plumbing. <laughs> Anywho, I've been trying to get a distress call to the Galactic Rangers ever since Drax forces showed up. Uh, this entire region is overrun with Blargy and dropships. We need to get you out of here. Well, I can't go anywhere until I get this here info bot into the hands of Captain Quark. We were on our way to speak with him when our ship was shot down. Perhaps we could take a look. Well, sure thing. I swabbed it from one of those Blarg soldiers. Here you go. Oh, hello there. I'm Alonzo Drek, chairman of Drek Industries. Many of you may be wondering, why are 300 heavily armed warbots marching ominously towards a Class G dreadship? <laughs> the answer is simple, friends. Progress! Years ago, we were driven underground by pollution that may or may not, but most definitely was, caused by my father's company. Since then, we've shifted focus from robotics to planet building! Now that our project is nearing completion, we must do everything possible to stay on schedule. In this case, it means our friendly army of warbots must vanquish those who would seek to stop us. Good news? They don't know we're coming! So sit back, relax, and take comfort in the knowledge that Drek Industries is working for you! Drek Industries is not working for you. I see you're having a little transportation trouble. Why don't I meet you by your ship? We'll get you squared away and ready to fly. Dragable! Did that guy just slide down a sewer pipe? Hmm. Well, it does look like the fastest way down. 
Let's give it a shot. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Was awesome. Want to do it again? Okay, let's see what we got here. And so, set out to fix their ship with the help of the plumber. Little did they know they would soon come so close to greatness, they'd be able to hear its mighty biceps ripple. But first, they'd have to tackle a brain eating zombie T Rex. Hey, wait a minute. I don't recall no brain-eating zombie T-Rex. Okay, fine. Killjoy. Well, you look about all fixed up here. Now promise me you'll get that infobot to Captain Quark. I promise. Thanks for your help. No problem. See you in the next reboot. Man, you got a lot of bolts. But get rid of some of them and buy a proton drum from me. Ratchet and Clank were delighted to discover that their newly repaired ship now had an upgraded hyperspace navigation computer. Let's see if we can help out Skid McMarks. Wait, is that Skid McMarks up ahead? Oh, someone help me! Good choice! Enjoy your new proton drum! Two dudes showed. I've been out here all night. I can't believe it. Skid McMarks. I have seen every one of your races. You pulled off a triple Nova spin at Mach 2 at last year's Kerwin Cup. It's always good to meet a fan, little dude. I am Clank. This is Ratchet. Your uncle received your infobot and asked us to assist you. Oh, I was wondering if he got that. My agent and I have been running from those blog all night. Only we ended up getting separated in the chaos, and I took a gnarly fall getting out of the Skid McMark sports shack. Hey, think you dudes can clear out the sand shark so I can get to my ship? Give me my hoverboard if you do. Whoa, a real McMark's 4000? Consider it done. Watch out for those sand sharks, bro. <laughs> Up there, that must be Skid's ship. Looks like there are a few sand sharks up there on the plateau. Think you can take care of them?
going for some food. You know, like a cheeseburger or some space pizza. I think Quark Scrub Grab still delivers this leg. Man Sharks on the plateau! Ratchet finds his very first gold bolt. Let's savor the moment. Okay, enough savoring. Moving on. Was pretty awesome. Thanks for your help. Here's your hoverboard. Oh, and it's autographed to Ratchet and Clank, the chillest dudes I've ever hung out with on a hostile alien planet. <gasps> cool. Will you be able to get home on your own? I'll be okay, though I don't think I'll be able to compete in the Blackwater City hoverboard competition. Kind of a bummer, dude. Hey, have either of you little dudes seen my agent? I feel kind of bad leaving him out here. We should search the area for Skid's agent. He may need our assistance. Hey, why don't you upgrade the proton drum?
lot of ammo. Uh oh, reinforcements. That's the last of them. That was impressive. Attention, future consumer. We thank you for your interest in the Skid McMark Sports Shack. However, your refusal to leave has forced us to activate the Constructo Bots. Have a nice day. My sensors are picking up a strange energy signature near the swing shot targets. I believe it may be a gadget from Drek Industries. All right, let's have a look around. on my store. Hey, it doesn't look like much now, but it's gonna be awesome! We're gonna have hoverboards, a swing shot course, and even a 24-hour talk to the dance this late night munchy munch attack. Ah, Skid McMars here! Hey, don't let old man Winter bum you out. Visit our snowboard department and pick up the latest snow shredding technology. It's never too cold to be cool! You know, anybody can buy stuff that looks cool, but unless you sound cool, you won't be cool. So check out our class schedule and sign up for the cool seminar, where you'll learn to look, sound, and even smell cool, like me! <laughs> you ready to catch some waves? Jaw oh, tubular! Dudes, have I got a deal for you! Just head over to the Pro Sheriff's Department and say the secret phrase, and get 5% off your next purchase! Loaded. Ratchet and Clank found a portable hydro displacer designed by Dr. Nefarious. This ingenious device promised to move water from one place to the other. Just a push of a button, the duo could now fill an entire swimming pool. Originally designed to unclog Valkyrie toilets, Ratchet would find the Hydro Displacer invaluable in navigating the sewers of the galaxy. Our intrepid Lombax delves the depth. We should search the area for Skid's agent. He may need our assistance. Intrusion detected in Sector 4. Dispatching Constructobots.
The finest selection of hoverboards, grab bikes, and gyrocycles will not be in stock until next fall. The only thing waiting for you here is death. Hey, Skipping Mark's here, and as you know, I'm a naturally talented hoverboard. You know what else is natural about me? Find out by visiting our herbal supplement department. You'll thank me later, man. No, seriously, you will. to Chairman Drek. Come on, don't make this hard on yourself. Give him up and no one gets hurt. Yeah, I'm telling you, I don't know where he is. You know celebrities these days. They do whatever they want. We can work this out, can't we? Oh, we'll work it out by feeding you to the sand sharks. <laughs> You're trying to kill me! Take out the law back! Oh boy, out of ammo! <laughs> <laughs> There's more of them! Hey, get them off my back, and I'll make you famous! Now that's impressive! Have either of you thought about a career in professional sports? I think that's all of them. Hey, you must be the two heroes who saved my client, huh? Don't tell me, don't tell me. Socket and Clink. Ratchet and Clank. Right, right, beautiful. Sprocket and Plank. I like the sound of it. Real marketing potential. I could sell that. Uh, listen, my client and I got separated in our somewhat hasty trek back to the ship. I'd go meet up with them, but this place is crawling with sand sharks. Think you can help me out? You have nothing to fear, sir. The sand sharks have been dealt with. Beautiful! Beautiful! You two have heart! I can sell that. We are always happy to assist. We really appreciate you helping us out. So where are you off to now? A hospital, I guess. Gotta get this leg checked out. A hospital? Skid, come on. You've been through worse. Uh, what are we gonna do about your sponsors? Um, I'm beginning to think you don't, like, care about me or whatever. <sighs> Fine. Uh, what about you, Renshi? Ratchet. Exactly. You want to be a hoverboard star? This infobot will give you all the details. Just tell him Don Wonderstar sent you. It's that time again. The annual Blackwater City Hoverboard Competition on Planet Rogar. Are you a young thrill seeker looking to show off your hoverboard skills? 
Then blast on over to Real Gar and experience the pulse pounding thrill of doing Mach 3 on a rocket powered piece of plastic. How exciting is the race? Just listen to some of our previous champions. I never miss the Blackwater City hoverboard competition, uh, except for next year's. I probably won't make that one. I can't feel my toes. Is that normal? <laughs> We're offering cash prizes and hollow cards to the winners. So head to Planet Bilgar and take a shot at the most extreme sporting event in the galaxy. And they're trying not to die. Wow, we just saved a celebrity. I want to check out that hoverboard competition. We should head back to the ship. Disaster struck. For Ratchet did not have the key component required to help them traverse the ionized surface. Magna Boots. Which planet should we go to? You might enjoy the hoverboard races held on planet Wilgar. Attention residents of Blackwater City, as you may have noticed, we appear to be dealing with a small outbreak of amoeboids. Our security teams are working hard to rid the city of these creatures, but first, they have to wake up, get washed, brush their teeth, drive over here, I mean, really, it's a whole process. So until they arrive, the race is postponed. Please stay inside your homes while we manage the crisis. Thank you. Let's clear out those amoeboids. I have a new McMark's hoverboard I want to try out.